Here is elfin historian Brangwen Spurge, scholar of all things goblin. Why is he being catapulted across the bone cruel mountains into goblin territory? Because there is no one better equipped to bring a peace offering to Gog the Evil One, Dark Lord of the Goblins. And here's his host, goblin archivist Verfel, scholar of all things elf. And here is Verfel's adorable pet Ichthyod, Skardebeck. These two scholars should be the best of friends. But in the land of the Dark Lord Gog, spies are everywhere and no one can be trusted. Both Brangwen Spurge and Verfel, elf and goblin, are pawns in a bigger game, each with his own secret mission. One sends pictures of everything he sees, but the pictures seem to contain many errors. The other is questioned in secret in the dark of night and has every reason to lie and betray. Which one is telling the truth? And can they find friendship in common in time to save themselves and their enchanted nations from all out war? I, M.T. Anderson, and my collaborator, Eugene Yelchin, created this book as a tribute to all of those brave writer explorers in the ancient world who voyaged into unknown lands and tried to understand the cultures they found there. People like Marco Polo and Xuanzang and Herodotus. Explorers? This is a spy thriller. Think uh, espionage. Think the spy who came in from the cold for the younger set. <laughs> but Eugene, at its heart, it's really a tragic meditation on how societies which have been trained to hate one another for generations can actually come to see eye to eye. A tragedy. A laugh out loud misadventure of two fools blinded by ideology and propaganda is not a tragedy, sir. It's a comedy. Sure, Eugene, whatever. Basically, we just wondered why goblins get such a bad rap in Tolkien and all those other fantasy novels, and why they're always seen as faceless masses who just deserve to be slaughtered, and what it's actually like to live in the barren realm of an oppressive evil lord. Who's Tolkien? Never heard of him. I, I, I don't care for fantasy. Okay, is this conversation over? I have to get a root canal. Root canal? My first root canal was done in Siberia by a KGB dentist without anesthetic. Wait, wait. Anderson, where are you going? <laughs>